everybody, I'm Josh. I'm Jason. I am going to take five minutes, probably probably less. Say what you need to say, Josh. What you going? You going to take you to the bathroom? No, I'm going to need water. You getting some water? All right. Everybody, I'm Josh. That was Jason. We're going to watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge, episode 73, Throw Haga from the Train. I don't get the reference of the name. Jace, do you? Bro, what? Throw, and then it says H-A-G-A, -A, Haga. No, I don't, he don't know. I don't know if you can hear that, but he don't know what Haga is. I don't know what Haga is. So, and I, you know what? Fuck Google. I'm not Googling it. Comment section, that's where you come in. Do your best. Jace, this is the episode where Yugi murders Weevil. I remember. <laughs> Monster Coddle. Man, the, the heart of the cards just hates Weevil. Berserker Soul? You remember the names of the cards? Of you know, course I do. They're not real cards. No shit. Doesn't mean I can't remember them. By the way. What? Make sure you guys hydrate. Cause I certainly don't hydrate enough. Yep. Uh, I do like the I do like the aesthetic of um Yugi dueling on top of a train. I do like duels that have like cool locations like that. Like dueling on top of a train. Or they're gonna talk about Geez, we're dueling on top of the train. What's next? Dueling with motorcycles? Oh God, you just know it. No, you're right. They're gonna do that. They're gonna they're gonna say something. And then um, so okay, I'll tell you this. And I watched part of Zexel before. I don't even know why I did Zexel it. Zexel sucks, doesn't it? It's it's bad. Which one did that introduce? Uh, Exceed. Exceed. Yeah. So the thing that I thought was pretty cool is that there's a duel that takes place on a roller coaster. Huh. And based, it was, it, I say, I say roller coaster, but the, the mechanics of it were more like go-karts where like people could just pop in and out of frame whenever they wanted. It was literally like, like the main character was dueling some people, but then some other dudes would show up and like gang, gang, gang up on them. I'm like, it was, it was, the, the rules were BS, but I'm like, this is kind of cool visually at least. Like the physics makes no sense. Or just the, the ruling makes no sense. But anyways, oh, another thing, uh. Joey summons Gear Freed the Swordmaster. For that the he first does. Time. Like, oh yeah, that's uses that's right, Gear Freed. And he uses its ability with uh, Red Eyes Black Dragon Sword. Uh huh. I was like, I'm excited. That was a really cool move. Like, that's right, Gear Freed. Take it off. And then he <laughs> takes it off. Like, play plays sexy music. Like, oh my god, he's hot. Mm. It's okay. It's okay, Rex. Just. To, Josh, what, just, what? do you have latent homosexual feelings? No. It's like, uh, or excuse me, tendencies? No. Is it, it's just, sure? Yeah, it, it, Rex is just like, it's okay, Rex. Just imagine him in his underwear. <laughs> oh no, he's hot! Alright, let's go. I was barely in the new movie, but I still got paid more than Kaiba. It's bullcrap! How come you can't come with us to Florida, Duke? Usually I would. go to Florida? I, charged my I can't. In four I don't like that. Oh. super quiet. <laughs> Listen to his theme music. Stops altogether. We're on our way to save the world, and it's all thanks to California's reliable public transit system. Oh, no. Next up, Florida. The train at Platform Five has been delayed because someone dropped their water bond card on the tracks. Somehow, this will take well over an hour to correct. We would apologize for the inconvenience, but you knew what you were signing up for when you bought the ticket. Well, this they play it backwards. Hey, let's play a game to pass the time. I'll go first. I spy with my little eye something, something that's in with T. Anybody? Come on, anybody? It's train. train. Come on, guys. That was an easy one. Okay, round two. I spy with my little eye something beginning, beginning with T. T. Yep. It only took five hours, but we're on our way. I'm glad we spent all our money on this bag of potato chips and generic oh brand God. soda. That's weird. The Pharaoh usually loves generic brand soda. Without Yugi, he just isn't himself. Hey, Pharaoh. I just want you mm -hmm. to know that I'm here for you if you need to talk. Mm -hmm. And if there's anything any of us can do to help, then mm -hmm. just feel free to mm -hmm. ask. Hey, Taya, did you notice the way I'm sitting? What? Pretty cool, huh? I'm calling it the cross-leg corner sit-down technique. Trademark Tristan Taylor. Tristan, the Pharaoh is having an existential crisis. You know what's a real crisis? The fact that nobody else is sitting like this. Yugi. This is your driver speaking. He punches the wall. I remember that. And you broke my hand! 
bunch of holograms on the tracks. Looking like a delay of up to about eight hours. <clears throat> and somebody just punched the train, so that's another two hours on top of that. That's pretty good. <laughs> You guys notice anything weird? Yeah, it's almost like everyone on this train magically disappeared. How the hell did we miss that? Well, I was busy coming up with a revolutionary new sitting technique. There'd better be a good explanation Yeah, what the fuck? Where did everybody go again? Darts. How did you manage to make all the passengers on that train disappear? Magic. That, that's it? I was kind of hoping there'd be more to it than- Nope. Magic. Well, where did they go? Magic land. I was gonna ask you why your hair isn't changing color anymore, but I'm <gasps> guessing it was magic. Oh man, I just washed the dye out of it. I'm a next <laughs> uh, turquoise. <laughs> Holy <laughs> turquoise! Separating. Oh no, Pharaoh! Don't worry, Taya. Just throw me Joey's deck, and I'll take care of this. <laughs> or you can just jump across, I suppose. Just Joey. Story. Joey's What's deck. That? I couldn't hear you over the train. I said just. Oh. I guess we'll never know what he was suggesting. Great, we're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Now it'll take us forever to get to Florida. In other words, slightly faster than taking the train the whole way. <laughs> hey, look! It's a minor antagonist. I bet he's going to antagonize us. What the hell, Rex? Weren't you just hanging out with the Oricalcos guys? How'd you get back to California and get on this train so fast? I guess I'm full of surprises, Wheeler. Wait, that oh. wasn't a sex joke or a reference to a 90s cartoon. What gives here? The antagonizing has begun. Hello? Can anyone hear me? No answer. Something must have happened to the driver. Great. Now how is he supposed to not get us there on time? <laughs> Where are you going? Without a driver, this train is out of control. I gotta get in there. There could be a hatch on top. Let's climb this ladder. I gotta get up there. Just promise you won't look at my butt. I gotta get in there. I said do <laughs> <laughs> Weevil. Only you could be evil enough to make a bunch of people disappear and then detach part of a train from the rest of the train. Let me guess. You're gonna call us fart knockers or butt munches or something. Sorry to disappoint you. But after I'm done doing it, it does kind of sound like Weevil. to be calling you is loser. Won't that be a bit weird when I win? Pharaoh, listen to him. People usually call me the winner when I win. His voice is so different. Maybe he's possessed by the spirit of a mighty Pharaoh who wins all the games he plays. Oh wait, that's me. That's me. That's not all that's different, Taya. Allow me to introduce my newest card, the Seal of Oricalco. On the first turn. <laughs> I, even as a kid, I thought it was weird how all the bad guys had to see a boy calculus in the first turn. The viewers saw your butt when you fell. Yeah. Thank goodness for that. It was vitally necessary. Okay, Dino Dorts. Good job, you get. First, your voice sounds different, and now you're working for Dorts and his goons. For Dorts? Understand, Wheeler. The Oracalcos doesn't just give us the power to take people's souls. It also gives us the power to retcon stupid ass decisions, like making me sound like butthead. I don't know, Dino Brain. You <laughs> That's pretty good. Butthead to me. Joey, if you lose the duel, you lose your soul. Right. We we know. I know how to weigh my options here. That's huge fucking hair. Did you see that? By taking this kid's soul and leaving him nothing but an empty shell. Such by the way, angle. I memorized several dozen dinosaur puns just so I could use them in this duel. Okay, so I'm not gonna feel bad about taking. I'm not beating you're about to receive, Wheeler, because Jurassic's mine. Oh. Okay? It's like your ass is mine, except okay, it's. Okay, yeah, let's do this. I yeah. summon the sexually frustrated Celtic Guardian. I'm so what? Sexually awful. Come on a train. Sorry, Yugi, but thanks to Parasite Caterpillar's effect, all your monsters transform into insects. And my insect barrier card prevents any insect monsters from attacking me. You're powerless. <laughs> Man, this guy's really bugging me. Get it, Taya? <sighs> bugging me? Yeah, I get it. You didn't laugh, though. I'm kind of busy trying not to fall to my death. Okay, but next time. You use DNA surgery. Next time. Be careful, yeah. Pharaoh. Instead. Did he? Don't worry, Taya. In the original build, yeah, he used I think DNA maybe he just used that to turn a Noxious Celtic Dude. Guardian into a bug, but then later, he uses, everyone else turns into bugs. Use a useful, useful Yu-Gi-Oh character, Tristan is. Use your special ability to attack Joey directly. Why is your 
Lucas saw shooting freaking flying saucer laser beams. I'm more confused than I am in pain. She's supposed to be like a regular dinosaur. Yeah, I know. If I lose the duel, I lose, lose my, my soul. soul. Got it. You do. Yes, I got it, Tristan. <laughs> you lose? No. You do. Oh, God. Now watch as your obnoxious Celtic guardian becomes an obnoxious Celtic poison butterfly. I'm so poisonous. Man, Weevil, you're really bugging me. Uh, Much better. This is for humiliating me in the Duelist Kingdom tournament, Yugi. Before you came along, I had it all. Money, fame, all the insect themed monster cards I could ever want. And then you had to ruin everything. But now, with the power of the Auricalcos, I can regain my former glory. Can I let you in on a secret? Huh? You were never all that good. In fact, you sucked. I was Ooh. the regional champion. Yeah, because everybody else sucked even worse. Remember when you threw away my Exodia cards? You bet I do. Ever think maybe you should have kept them? What? Why Ooh. would I? Because that's what a not terrible duelist would have done. Not throw away some of the most powerful cards in the game. It was all part of my plan. To... Hell, I sucked back then too. I had freaking Mushroom Man in my deck when Ooh. I beat you. If you were attempting to distract me from the beaten by a person who chose to put Mushroom Man in their deck. That's how Remember when Karibo sucks. became an insect? He just grew little antennas. Him, Come on, Taya, it's Weevil! <laughs> it's so Weevil! You do. Well, you don't have Mushroom Man now, or your Egyptian Ooh. God cards, or Yugi so. Oh, remember what Weevil does? You'll have even less than nothing! Yeah, that's fucked up. <laughs> but you know what I do have right now? One of these. Oh no! The Eye of Tamias! That's right! And now, yeah! The Eye of Tamias with Poison Butterfly in order to summon... Oh. No! Oh. The two monsters that don't fuse with each other didn't fuse! My bullshit main character powers have failed me! If I'm struggling this much against Weevil, Joey must be in serious trouble. This is like the easiest duel I ever played. Now I fuse red eyes. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! To give my gear free to Swordmaster his very own red eyes black dragon sword! I love having bullshit main character powers. Yeah. I bet that feels great. Being the main character and all, you'll never understand what it's like to be what I am. To be less than a joke. Before, everyone loved us. Oh, we they were so short, to too. Back to an old Mike Judge cartoon. Look, it's those guys who talk like Beavis and Butthead. I love things that are lifted directly from other sources. But soon enough, the gag got old. People started to figure out that we really didn't bring anything to the table. Hey, aren't you those two morons, Rex and Weevil? <laughs> you said. References aren't funny! <laughs> Mug him, beat the fuck out of him. Point of mind. Wait, what? Did you see? <laughs> Why are you laughing at my tragic backstory? Hold on, I'm about to try to help me wake up. Peed on you. <laughs> <laughs> you guys see me falling asleep. Come on, Rex, you should be A bad. dog peed on you. Genuine laugh, you can't. Character is produced on this show. Now, gear free, attack Rex and only reluctantly take his soul. <laughs> Rex, <laughs> if you lose the duel, you <laughs> lose your soul. Tristan. Who knew? Apparently, the seal of Oricalcos also makes a five year old Photoshop your eyes closed. I summon Ew. Rika, the magical warrior. That's a pretty cool card, Yugi. Wanna see one of my favorite cards? Is it Mushroom Man? Because you look like a guy who uses Mushroom Man. Master Darts was kind enough to give me the card containing Yugi's soul. I thought you might appreciate being reunited with him before I destroy you. The only reunion that's about to happen is my size 10 with your buttocks. Bill, don't antagonize him. Come on, Taya, it's Weevil. It's Weevil. Oh, the worst he could. Okay, yeah, that's the worst. Oh, shit. <laughs> Don't worry, Pharaoh. It was just a prank. I don't it's just a prank. It's just a prank, bro. Is, but I know where yours is going to be once Poison Butterfly drains the last of your life points. You know, it really is a shame. If Yugi were here, he might have been able to prevent me. Prevent you from what? From killing you. This. I activate Berserker's soul. Now I must keep drawing cards. 
And for every monster card I draw, Breaker attacks. But what are the odds that I'll draw a monster card? <laughs> this sucks. Draw! Monster card off! <laughs> draw! Monster card off! <laughs> Shroom Man. The dude doing the Japanese voice. Monster card off! Draw! Did Jerry beat me? <laughs> Fuck him up. No, what a surprise. This next one's up. No, Yamate! Yugi! Yamate! What the fuck? <laughs> Why did they go Japanese? <laughs> Why doesn't he just draw? If, if the power of the Millennium... Draw! draw! Oh. Mm. The power. Shut up. If the power of the uh, Millennium. Julian <laughs> Yami's deck is 90% Masakados. If the power of the. We apologize, but the incoming train from California has been slightly delayed due to being hurled violently off the tracks and falling off a cliff. We expect it to arrive in about four and a half. That's right, it's been delayed by about a month. In the meantime, please enjoy the cold isolation that comes with traveling by train. Trains, we get you where you're going. Eventually. Nowhere. Eventually. Uh, Man, little crew must have some bad experiences with trains. As I was saying. Yes. The power of the... The power... If... The power of the uh, Millennium Puzzle allows Yugi to... Will to basically draw whatever card he needs. Why doesn't he just? Why can't? Why wouldn't that just allow him to just spam Berserker Soul? I don't know. Writing it would be interesting. So you're saying the Pharaoh's fucking cheating this whole time? Pegasus read read the person's mind. Uh, Merrick Sh used Shizu. mind control. Shizu read the future. Or looked at the future exactly. All cheating. <laughs> Yamate. That was ridiculous. So yeah, do you remember when? D yeah, I saw the corner of it, you were right. It was DNA surgery, and little Karibo turned into... No, a a actual Karibo you had in the field. It grew little antennas. Remember that? Not really. Darts, how'd you get rid of all those passengers? Magic! Well, where did they go? Magic man? Magic. It's like, is that why your hair... I was gonna ask why your hair's not changing colors anymore, but I was going to assume magic. Nah, I just washed that out of it. <laughs> I'm a natural turquoise -y. I, I mean, think it, no it one's was, a natural turquoise. It was just, it was just too. It, I can understand like the it's a extra editing to have him constantly having changing hair color, but I just love. I just watched Dab, man. They just, I do like. I think it's funnier that they did it for a bit without acknowledging it, and then they just stopped. I do think that's funny. Uh, let's wrap up the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. I'm Josh. I'm Jay. We'll see you guys in the next one.